Okay. I'm going to do a funnel pour. I'll start with a little pink. We're just going to alternate these colors here. And then we're just going to... I'm holding the bottom by my finger. Red. Blue. Throw in a little bit of white. I know we've got way a lot of paint here. That's okay. Green. And purple. And it didn't quite do as much as I hoped, so that's good. These funnel pours, they come out so quick. I'm just going to let that sit there and drain. But you know what? Wouldn't hurt me just put it down in there. What did I do with it? What did I do with it? What did I do with it? It's one of these days, people. I'm losing my head. Let's see what we can come up with. Want to? Hope you don't lose all the blues and the greens. Maybe I didn't make up enough paint because it's slowly dragging. Maybe I should have put a base. It's slowly going. Yep. Yeah. Sometimes you just have to keep tilting and let it stretch. Go corner to corner. Our biggest problem is getting this big corner. Sometimes, yeah, sometimes you just have to use your fingers, too, and drag it down. And we have this big section down here. See if we can get it to stretch. To 
be honest, I can't tell if it's stretching or not. Yeah, it is slowly. Very slowly. Sorry, I know it's hard for you to see. Sometimes you gotta hold it straight up and down to get it to stretch. The next one I'm gonna do, hopefully it's going to intrigue you. I'm gonna do a spin with a sink drain. Yeah, I like that. It's got cells popping up. Didn't really have to use cell magic on this one. I think that was because there was a little bit of cell stuff in the bottle from when I mixed it before. Yeah, that turned out pretty good. What do y'all think? Yes or no? I kind of like it. I've gotten to where I was in the copper phase there for a while. Now I'm into the pinks and the blues. What I call the cotton candy colors. You have these phases that you go through. And I don't know. Do one thing, then you fall in love with it, and you try another. Let me torch this and see. This torch has fuel in it, it just doesn't want to come out very well. I don't know if it has to do with the uh, fan blowing on it or what. Well, I'm going to cut off the video. I'm going to take a still shot, wash up, put everything away, and then I'm going to do the spinning uh, strainer. And we'll get that going. See you in a few.